Hello guys, and welcome to the very first modded Minecraft Monday. I'm Christianato, here to welcome you to modded Minecraft Monday. We are playing a pack called Egg Block. <clears throat> it is an interesting pack based off of, well, if you can guess, chickens. <clears throat> I chose this mod pack because I like the way that most mod packs go about their chicken resources. So I figured I'd create a mod pack. Well, I'd do a mod pack based off of this. I was not the creator of this. Did not mean to say that. I'm not taking any of the credit of this. And <clears throat> anyway, so here we go. Opening the quest book and... Looks like we got two quests available to us, and all these resources and stuff, I guess, will come later. <clears throat> Naturally, saplings. <clears throat> Sorry, I got a little bit of cold. Um, <clears throat> you can craft a sapling with living roots obtained from the big roots sticking out of your island. To grow that sapling, pork, or sprint around it, and make sure it's not below the mana flare. Okay, so basically you're just hitting shift when you make you twerk, in case you didn't know that. Um Okay, guess that's the mana flare. Okay. Uh, those are the roots that we need to break down in order to get the roots that we need for the saplings. So here we go. <clears throat> um just gonna mine down here quick, easily, uh, safely, as safely as I can. It's a little dangerous, and well, okay. Looks like I got water if I fall, and I wanna make sure I save this dirt, because dirt will definitely come in handy. Always does. Oops, crap. Well, there goes some of them. Uh, looks like we got four. Most mod packs, that should be enough. Just crafting it like that. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Perfect. So, there we go. <clears throat> now, I just need to try and safely get back up there. And there's some bedrock. To... I think I'll just build this back up to how it was. And maybe I'll do something with that later. But, here we go. Let's get that working. There we go. <clears throat> Okay, does this have FDB Ultimine? Maybe not. Ah, perfect. Or Excavate, whatever it's called. <clears throat> different mod packs are called different things. Um, so in this case, looks like it is available. So, if you guys are playing this pack, it's pretty easy, and as you can see, it's pretty nifty. Um, <clears throat> come on. Oh. Um. Yeah. It allows for the cutting down the entire tree. You know what? While I'm at it, might as well just break all this down. <clears throat> Could always use the dirt. Oops, crap. No, 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 no. Oh. Let's see if I can get this. Looks like I got some of it. Okay, looks like I might have gotten it. Not that I really need it, um, <clears throat> so basically I just want to gather all this dirt because it could become useful later on, um, actually, I'm probably just going to build out with it and so I got this nice grass platform in the middle, it's usually a pretty good thing to, especially if we're dealing with chickens, which will, be, uh, which will require farming. <clears throat> Having that in the middle would be pretty good. Um, so yeah. Basically, if I can just do this. Oh, come on, let me stay on. You know what, I'm just gonna... Might as well grab this. It's not gonna hurt. <clears throat> um. Okay. 
This water will probably come in handy. Will definitely come in handy later. Not probably. Will definitely come in handy later. Crops, and I just lost another piece of dirt. Yay, I'm doing kind of terribly here. <clears throat> Don't mind me just messing up. Now I need to get back up. Best way to do that is just to waste a couple of plantings. <clears throat> so now I can build out. And that way I can have a whatever size this will be platform for planting later on. <coughs> um. So yeah, here we go. Oh great. Um. <coughs> Next, I'll put, I'll just put these down for now. Maybe I'll get a way to find dirt later on. Um. And let's grow these trees. Of course, that's directly underneath. Um, you know what? Four by. Alright, let's do. Oh, yes, I have enough for another one. Let's get four of them down. That way we can get trees as fast as possible. Here we go. <clears throat> and if I stand in the middle, these should grow. Hopefully. <clears throat> Come on. Which one of you wants to go first? There we go. <clears throat> Um, so what I was talking about earlier, the grave key, basically, well, the, oh, excavate, hold down the grave key in order to do that. The grave key would just so happen to be the button right next to the one. <clears throat> hold that down while you're chopping down, it allows you to excavate, which really does pretty good. Um, it's a little annoying, just a little ambiance, wish there was a little music to this, maybe I'll find some music for later episodes, but <clears throat> anyway, um, back to the quests. Ooh, loot chest, okay. <clears throat> Let's get some cobble. You can shift plus right click on glass. Or to, to obtain pebbles with which you can craft cobblestone. Okay. Let's open this loot chest and Ooh. That is pretty good. Um I don't get that. Yeah. <clears throat> Man. Um so that's actually pretty useful. Uh, it's not exactly useful for now. Um, <clears throat> if I could get more, that would be useful because it takes a lot to eventually get the um, man it cost. Yeah, it's pretty expensive to get the inspiring. And then perfected is wow, that's just stupid. But with that, you can get <clears throat> basically unbreakable tools. <clears throat> a sword that does fairly good on damage, um, and an axe that's Less of, that's worse at attacking, but well, it's next. We we'll chop down stuff pretty quickly. No real need for that right now. <clears throat> anyway, back to them. Man, this guy might turn this down just a second. Oh. Um, <clears throat> guess we're just gonna have to deal with that for now. Um, <clears throat> but this would be the only time that I'm gathering cobblestone, really. So, won't be too annoying. And we got the cobble. Man, it's already dope. 
I'm going kind of slow here. Ooh, I can be a pirate. <clears throat> Let's see how that looks on me. Doesn't look that bad. My eye patch doesn't seem to be working. Unsure why of that, um, but it's weird. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe it's because of my skin, I guess. I don't know. But it's kind of fun. Perfect. Now I got an even number. <coughs> Except for the cobblestone. But, oh well. <coughs> I don't care about that. Um. <coughs> Trade in half a stack of logs for five log chickens. Ooh, nice. Then I won't have to really gather logs anymore. I'll basically just get them. Um. <coughs> that'd be nice. Let's go about getting that. Right. Come on. Might be a little too close to that. Uh, dang. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I know this is a little slow to begin with, but... It should pick up later. Um, <clears throat> once I've got resources going and everything, I'll be able to... Make some good things. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to fence in my chickens then and all that fun stuff. So, yeah. <clears throat> so, here we go. Um, if you're watching this, thank you for watching this video. I know it's a little slow and I know I'm a little. <clears throat> kind of bad at YouTube right now, it's just beginning, but if you're watching this, that means you actually took the time to try and find what my first video was, and yes, this is my first solo video. Um, if you know anything about me, I started with the YouTube <clears throat> group, the technicians first, um, started that group, and... Maybe it's going well when you're watching it, maybe it's not, I don't know. I'm on, I'm kind of unsure of it right now. Um, <clears throat> my buddy Zach, who's working on it with me, we kind of have schedules that kind of conflict with each other, it seems, so it might not work out too well. <clears throat> but, it's a fun project to work on anyway. <clears throat> A lot more fun to be working on things with a friend than working all by yourself and just to... Basically the main thing you hear is your own voice. <clears throat> Which... I don't know if you guys find it annoying, but I kind of do. <clears throat> I don't know what's with my voice. I'll be... Maybe I'll get a good voice later on, or maybe this is just the voice I'm stuck with. Either way. This is how it is. And I just gotta deal with it. <clears throat> but. Um. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what to say during these things. Um. But. Just gonna be talking to you guys. Hopefully, somebody's. At some point, is listening. That'd be nice. <clears throat> So basically what I want to do with this channel is I wanted to make a fun channel where I could make a few different videos each day, um, play some games for you, some, a lot of the games, games I wouldn't normally play by myself, that way I could get a better experience of it and you guys could have fun, especially with the horror games I plan on playing because, well... <clears throat> You guys are watching this channel, you guys know that 
fine. I kind of scare pretty easily, I think. <clears throat> Which will make it pretty fun for you guys, right? Come on. <clears throat> this is one big tree. I just didn't want to come down. And, oh. There we go. Landed safely. <clears throat> no broken ankles or anything. Now, time for completing this quest. <clears throat> and now I need to create a small little platform for them. So, one of the best ways is to get some sticks. And... No. It's like this. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> Grab some sticks to create fences. <clears throat> Obviously, fencing in your animals is the best way to do things. That way they can't run away and... Don't have to worry about them. Really. Um... <clears throat> So, <clears throat> this is not my first time playing. <coughs> this is not my first time playing this mod pack. Um, I'm a little experienced at this. Um, <clears throat> one thing you want to do is you want to make sure you've got uh, slabs down. Because. <clears throat> Otherwise, you can get some mobs spawning that you might not want. Such as... On one of my, on my playthrough, I had an ocelot spawn. <clears throat> Went straight after my chickens and kind of ruined my entire playthrough because, well... Without the log chickens, you can't really do too much. So anyway... <clears throat> Um, let's, let's get some Tinko stuff done. Um, <clears throat> not very good with Tinkers, so I won't be using it a lot, but always helps to get some rewards or stuff. <clears throat> so, if we start off like this, and like this. You know what? Okay. So if we get some of these. Oh, quiet down. You okay in there? You drop me any reward? Anything? Nope. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah, let's get some Tinker stuff done. Might as well make a sword while I'm at it, once I get this stuff done. And I need the crafting table, yeah, that's what... <clears throat> I was like, what's the last part? Oh yeah, the tool station. Um... <clears throat> next, we'll need two chests. Because it looks like we're building the Tinker's chest as well. Um... Pattern chest, and I think it's like this. There we go. The pout chest. That should be two quests complete. Ooh, a balloon. <clears throat> some help. Room service. Anyway. <clears throat> um, so, stencil table goes down. Pull station and pout builder. Pout chest should go right behind pout. And pattern chest should go right behind stencil table. <clears throat> so what you do. Yeah. Place these in here. 
get the patterns you need. There you go, straight into the pattern chest. Now, if I did this correctly, some mod packs do things differently. Okay. Looks <clears throat> like I'll need to get them out. Because apparently it doesn't like it that way. Of course. So if I get the tool rod, the wide goad pattern, well, the wide goad, and the blade. <clears throat> Bet you can guess what I'm making with this. I don't know why I'm making a stone or well, wooden while well, I already have stone, but here we go. It is ecological. Basically, it's very ecological. Not very good on durability. Um, might as well bring it up. <clears throat> Oops. Oh, tree. I can take you down. Oh. Okay. Let's see. What all can I do with an apple? Looks like we can't cook it. Man. <clears throat> That's one of the best things. <clears throat> all this other junk is... Too hard to make with and oh fruit salad that's worthless. Fruit punch, ooh, fruit punch. Um if I can get if I get sugar cane that would be a little useful. Still not that good. <clears throat> um Yeah, I don't see anything actually worthwhile. That can actually make... Okay, so this will actually <clears throat> double the resourcefulness of apples, but... It's all still pretty crappy. <clears throat> like, you need all this stuff, and I'm like... It's just not worth it. Darkened apple. <clears throat> okay. Might eat that at some point. Just because it says I wouldn't eat it. So, I probably will. <clears throat> um. But yeah, as you guys can see, we're getting wood. From the chickens. And also getting some manure. <clears throat> is actually actually is pretty useful <clears throat> um yeah what's the next chip plus um bones okay like a simple mob thumb and kill a skeleton <clears throat> okay so the next quest is to kill a skeleton Basically, what we want to do there is make a mob farm. Gotta make it some distance away, otherwise they won't spawn. So, let's get about doing that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I like making it 20 blocks out, about, and I make like making it, <clears throat> making a two wide pattern about there. Uh, one, two, three, four. <clears throat> then I went 10 one way. And I'll be going 10 the other way then. Basically setting that in the middle. And 
and <clears throat> setting an area where mobs can spawn and can be pretty easy for me to kill them. I like setting myself an extra layer back here. You do not exactly need it. <clears throat> um, mobs can't. If you make it only one wide like that, mobs cannot see you. <clears throat> so they'll be unable to hit you off the ledge. But I like a little extra security, making sure of everything, so... <clears throat> I like making sure everything is pretty good and safe for me, so I like doing it like this. You may have your own personal preference, but I find this is one of the best ways to create a mob spawn because really, as long as you don't mind having to manually kill them, it's not it's not exactly the best XP farm, but. <clears throat> I don't plan on doing too much killing of mobs, so it shouldn't be too bad. And then I want about a stack of this. <clears throat> should get me exactly what I want, and everything should be good. So you're gonna want to make this too high. Well, one and a half high, because <clears throat> then you can easily get them, and they cannot see you at all. And this is the area that the mobs will be spawning on. So I like to leave a little gap here, that way I can climb on up and finish building this. <clears throat> okay, then I will outline this with slabs, <clears throat> that way I'll be able to see their feet, oops, that was a mistake, now take a little bit to rectify, if I decide to do that, <clears throat> if I can get around to doing that, so, if you would build it like this, um, this is the best way. Basically, you got that slab there, which will make sure no light actually comes in to this. And will also make sure no mobs can uh, see out. So you will not get attacked. Um, <clears throat> the layer for standing on, you want to make sure that that is one... Uh, <clears throat> is a slab on the lower half and you want to make sure this is a slab on the upper half of the next of this layer that way everything is positioned correctly and that way no mobs can possibly spawn down there and that you can still fit underneath that little shade and attack some mobs um, basically you can make this whatever size you want. <clears throat> yeah, this stack was definitely not enough. What happened to all my extra- is that all in here? <clears throat> I'm just gonna take all of it out. A stack was not enough, um, but luckily I got these little guys producing wood for me. Oop, looks like nighttime's- Closing on pretty fast. <clears throat> Again. Um. So yeah. It's... So you can choose to make this three high. Well, I'd recommend making this three or four high. Um. That way you've got the best chances of spawning things like Endermen, maybe, 
if they do spawn in this pack. I don't know if they do or not. <clears throat> um, but if you make it like three high, they'll be able to spawn. And well, then crap, I do not have enough. Why do I? Oh. Okay, that was a little, little weird. Um, and you do want to cover this up with slabs. And it's not exactly best to be making this at night time because it can get dangerous. A uh, UFO way that mobs could possibly spawn from your starting point while you're at your starting point. But if you're quick about it, you won't get too many. <clears throat> there we go, our first skeleton kill already. As I said, it can be dangerous, but as long as you're quick. Ah! Basically what I'm doing here is making sure I can get all this area slapped up. Um, <clears throat> if you do not, there is a decent chance that you could get uh, mobs spawning on top. Which is not what you want because, well, why you want to make sure this is slabbed, all of it slabbed up is because Mobs can spawn up, and <clears throat> it's not fun to be having skeletons attacking you while you're trying to get things done. Trust me. It's while you're being distracted by your chickens, you can just get a surprise attack by a couple of skeletons on top of this, and it would not be very much fun. So, here we go. <clears throat> Almost done. And looks like we can return these back to wood planks. Perfect. Mob area is complete. Now if I just clean up my little mess here that I made. <clears throat> Here we go. Mobs will now spawn in here and I'll get <clears throat> some stuff from them. But the main reason I did that was so that I could complete that one quest, which will give me <clears throat> more chickens. Um, now I just need to grab a uh, great place for them. I just, yeah, build this out three. I can then set them there. Okay. Now it is best to create a place in between that way you can. <clears throat> Um, dang it. By the way, I'm not good at power core, as you could just see right there. Okay. Here we go. Now, if I just claim that quest. <clears throat> Let's see, will I get any? Oh, yes, one. Oops. How did... Are they able to go underneath that? Huh. Interesting. Yeah. Well, 
Well then, little buddy. Six slabs should be enough for you. Okay, so I'm learning some things. <clears throat> you, you better stay in there. Anyway. <clears throat> Let's grab some things, and what's the next? Oh, did I ever read that? <clears throat> Make a simple mob farm and kill a skeleton. Don't worry if you get nothing from the Grand White Chicken. Looks like we got two. <clears throat> As you'll be able to craft more later. Okay, I will ask the next question. <clears throat> so, we will be able to craft more. <clears throat> Use the bone meal from the bones that you got from the skeletons to grow grass. Break it to obtain seeds and make a tiny farm with them. You're going to need seeds for breeding and growing chickens faster. And you're going to need wheat for dirt, in a way. <clears throat> Wonder what that means, but, oh well. You little... <clears throat> bugger. You're gonna be annoying, aren't you? <clears throat> anyway, uh, excavate does work in grass and flowers. Okay. Got some flowers, but <clears throat> so far no. So the manure works exactly like bone meal. That's why it's actually pretty useful. Um, easier to get, and I mean, you can just crap it out. But so far no seeds. Okay, come on. What was that? Hops. What are these? Where's this drop for seed? Finally! <clears throat> Finally got one! Okay. So. The wooden hoe is the next thing. <clears throat> um. I need. And let's. Plant. There we go. That quest is now complete, but obviously with chickens, everybody knows to breed chickens, you need seeds, so might as well get as many as I can get. <clears throat> Five spawn chickens. Those are the regular chickens, and I think they drop special drops? Maybe? Maybe we'll find out. Maybe they just drop eggs. I don't know. Well, looks like we got feathers from other chickens, so. If they do just spawn eggs, we'll be good. Um, <clears throat> some of you may know what I'm going after. Um, when I say we'll be good, as long as we got feather and eggs. Um, <clears throat> The chicken catcher is something added in most chicken mod packs, which you can use to grab the chickens and come up and hold them as items. It's kind of interesting. <clears throat> if you haven't seen it before, we'll get there pretty shortly. Um, definitely before this video is over. <clears throat> So, here we go, about the regular chickens. We should just be adults, I'm thinking. Um, what happened to you? <clears throat> okay. Let's try that again. There we go. Now, for those of you with OCD, you don't have to be bugging me about it. <clears throat> I fixed it up right away. 
There we go. Regular chicken. <clears throat> Luckily, these chickens don't make too much of a noise. Or maybe they do. But anyway. <clears throat> now. I'm getting kind of hungry. Why the load do you do? Have fun with Mr. Gold. Hurling? Almost sounds like it. I mean, <clears throat> I'd ask if you need help, but I mean, I'm killing you anyway, so not that I really care. Looks like we got drying racks, so we should be able to make jerky or something. Probably something out of all of this rotten flesh. <clears throat> so, might as well just decorate the place with this so we can get some stuff going. Get some food going. Before I get hungry. Luckily, I don't need to worry about it in the real world because I just had cell food, so. <clears throat> And some of you probably having your supper now while you're watching this video. If you are having your supper now while watching this video, comment down below. Having supper. <clears throat> and we'll see how many people watch these videos while having supper. I guess. I don't know. I'm just crazy, okay? Just bear with me. Might need this bow later on, so... So that's not taking up anything. Um, anyway. <clears throat> that quest is done. The chicken catcher. If I could get an egg from you guys, that would be all I need. Doesn't look like there's an egg in there yet. Um, could sneak around and make sure, and no egg. No egg. So, I know this game kind of cluttered, but <clears throat> it is now time. I definitely need a chest um, for some of these items. Just placing it down so I don't, and I know this isn't very organized. I'll get organized later. I do not need this. Quest book, fly away! Um, I like uh, key binding my quest to my right shift button. It's just a button that's not useful for like anything, so. <clears throat> okay. Crushing table, and it's stone hammer. Well, um, let's see. Crushing table. <clears throat> that looks pretty soon too. Um, looks like we cannot bookmark that, so. Stone slab. Okay, so I will need. Come on, backspace. <clears throat> I'll need to create a furnace. Obviously, that should have been something I did anyway, but. <clears throat> anyway. Picking things up and it's just pop. Maybe that's the sound of them dropping something. Come on, any eggs? I like to make that chicken catcher. Pretty useful thing. <clears throat> anyway, I'll get that later.
Okay. So far, all we have is wood to burn. <clears throat> so, I only needed three. Yes. So, let's only make three. Um, <clears throat> well, let's cook in. Let's see, what does the stone hammer take? Um, cobblestone and two sticks. Okay. It's in a little weird pattern, but hey, who am I to judge? <clears throat> Here we go. Now I need the slabs. And I forget how that's made. So, here we go. Second so plants. No plants. <clears throat> I'm just placing all these tools in one area, that way I can get them kind of easily. Now, of course. <clears throat> one loot chest. Awesome. Huzzah. Ooh, a gold coin! It's pretty useless. Okay. <clears throat> who, who would have ever thought I'd say gold coin is pretty useless? Might as well keep this on me. Um, <clears throat> you didn't know this will increase its durability over time. Only when you have it in your hand. Well, only when you have it on you. Um. What is this? Monster jerky. Yep. So, killing zombies, I can get jerky from you. <clears throat> Which isn't terrible food. It's a lot better than the apple. So. Anyway. Next quest. <coughs> flint. Eight flint for a flint chicken. You can crush cobblestone down into gravel, which you can then craft into flint. Trade in 8 flint for 5 flint chicken. And with a stone hammer and crushing table, you'll be able to crush down certain blocks into other blocks. Simply right click with the hammer on the crushing table. So... I think I said this. Oh! Oops. <clears throat> the Enderman, okay. I can craft an Enderman statue. <clears throat> okay, so I will need more stone to do that. Might do that between episodes. Um Okay, the chicken catcher. I can get that now. <clears throat> it's one of the things I want to get. And once you, once you're old enough, I'll be able to put you guys to use. Okay. I don't know what's with that flashing in the background. It's weird. So, I, I should put an epilepsy warning on this video. <clears throat> okay. Luckily, it's in the background, so it shouldn't cause an issue. Black Lotus. Ooh. Okay. Um, if we ever have Batan- if we ever have to go through Batania, that would be useful. Ten of it. Nice. Um, <clears throat> for those of you wondering, basically what that does is it helps. It's very useful for Batania in getting mana. Um, one of the things I don't like Montax having. 
It's just the sky that, it's just the sky that glitches out. <clears throat> okay. So I'll try not to look at the sky when I'm in the crafting table or thing. Okay. That way you guys don't have to worry about that. I don't have to worry about that. Log chicken. Um. Okay, that's weird. Usually I have to breed them in order to get this, but um. So anyway, I don't really need it right now, and that did not give me anything. Perfect. Okay. So, it's already been about 50 minutes, I'll try and get another couple, I'll try and get another quest done, um, won't be able to get too much more done, because of time, <clears throat> but, I think this is a pretty good start, a watering can. Looks like it might only be at sunset that... The, up the screen, everything glitch up. Watering can. Four stone. Okay. And a bowl. Bowl is the hardest thing to get. <clears throat> um. Why do you like hanging out there? You're not gonna eat that. Are you? <clears throat> How much more time do you have? Okay. You got about two minutes to grow. Okay. Um. <clears throat> so, as you can see, this guy has about two more minutes to grow. I used a chicken catcher on him. On the one hand. <clears throat> I can then place him in here. And, hey! He's fully grown. Now he'll get me the resources that I want him to get. Come on. Perfect. And there we go. <clears throat> we now have our chickens. All grown up. It's one neat thing about the chicken catcher. It just will catch anything. Would catch <clears throat> any size chicken. But only allow you to place down adults. It will make them into adults. Which really helps. Oh, quiet down, you. I know I don't really have much of a need of this mob farm anymore. Um, <clears throat> as soon as I can get some coal, I think I'll light that up. That way I don't have to deal with mobs anymore. Um, well, I will still need it for the jerky. Okay, I'll wait until I can get a lot of chickens growing. Which might be before I get some coal, even. <clears throat> um. Ooh, carrot. Nice. Carrots, uh, they have a lot of recipes. <clears throat> Culinary generator, okay. Veggie strips, ew. Um. 
Always edible buffs player. Thank for dinner. If that wasn't so expensive, I might actually go for that. <clears throat> Stuff duck. Okay. Salad stock. Stock is kind of useful for some things, but overall not very useful. Um. <clears throat> it can allow you to make some things that are pretty neat. Anyway, um, enough about that. Even though, I've, enough going on tin. Um, <clears throat> and looks like these guys produce bone meal. Nice. Okay. So this is chicken block. Basically, it is your average sky block, just molded around chickens. <clears throat> yeah, I'll be doing an entire series on this, and I don't know how far in the quest lines I'll get, but eventually I plan on possibly completing this entire pack. I don't know quite yet, but hey, we got the watering can. And let's, <clears throat> before we close, let's open up one last loot chest. Um, <clears throat> even more Black Lotus. Okay. So, yeah. This is chicken block. Is it chicken? Is it? I think it's egg block. Egg block. Sorry. <clears throat> Egg block. Um, I think it's kind of neat. Um, molded around the chickens. And, <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoy it just as much as I do. I know I might be a little boring to talk, to listen to, but, I try to do good. So, if you enjoyed uh, like if you enjoyed this video please consider liking the video and hitting the bell to subscribe um <clears throat> be very useful and I'm and I'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers if I reach a thousand subscribers I'll do something special maybe I'll go live with my videos maybe I'll add another day um Another interesting day for you guys to watch. Probably won't be um, Minecraft, but it will probably be whatever you guys choose. I'll try to leave it up to you guys. <clears throat> you guys can have some fun with it, I think. Um, <clears throat> and um, if you have any suggestions on Minecraft mod packs that you'd like for me to play, um, put that in the comments below, and I'll see you about them. I'll check them out. Um, <clears throat> and hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, bye bye.